Hi, this is Don, and we're going to go over a problem from Chapter 10 uh, about a chi-square test for independence. And reading the problem here, we're given some data, a table, a uh, two-way table, since we've got uh, categories in the vertical, the first row, and more categories over here in the horizontal, so it's a two-way table. And the question is, can you conclude that the reason and type of worker are, are dependent? And the question is whether or not workers uh, give a reason for continuing education is related to their job type. And alpha is 0 0.01. So we're going to solve this using PHSTAT and Excel. I'm going to click on the icon and open it in Excel. We get our little spreadsheet dropping to the bottom. We'll open up the spreadsheet. Have to enable editing. I'm going to bring it over here. Here's our data. Now we want to do a chi-square test. So we go to the add-ins tab over to PHSTAT, multi-sample test, and we select chi-square test. We're getting given this dialog box our significance level was 0 0.01. Number of rows is 1, 2. Number of columns is 1, 2, 3. And I'm just going to click OK. And we're given this spreadsheet that's entered into our workbook. And uh, we've got a note here that says we enter our data in the blue. We've already carried over the level of significance. But all we have to do is enter our data, and in Excel, what we can do is just to highlight those cells, right-click, copy, go over here to the chi-square, enter the first cell, Control-V. So we've put our data into this prearranged shell that PHTAP makes for us, and it does all the calculations. Down here are our our answers. It gives us the critical value of chi-square of 9.21. We get a test statistic of 0.326 and a p-value of 0.894. Uh, the p-value tells us it's not significant and also the fact that the chi-square test statistic is not beyond, not greater than the critical value. That also tells us that we do not reject the null hypothesis. Okay, because we do not reject the null hypothesis, we would not be able to support the claim. There is insufficient evidence to support the claim. Remember when we're doing the chi-square test for independence, the null hypothesis is always that the factors are independent. In this case, the reason for getting the education and the type of job they do are not related. They're not dependent upon one or the other. The alternative is always that the factors are dependent upon one upon the other. In this case, the claim was that the, the factors were related, were dependent. Therefore, we do not have sufficient evidence to support the claim. Hope this helps.